All right, talking about something you don't see every day. This is the eclipse as seen from Dallas, Texas, because they were under the path of totality, along, of course, with several other cities and towns all across America, including here in New England. Thanks for staying with us, everyone. I'm JC Monahan. And I'm Colton Bradford. Let's go to one of those New England cities right now. They got to witness the total eclipse today. NBC 10's Matt Fortin live for us in Burlington, Vermont, with how things looked up near Lake Champlain, Matt. Colton, JC, it's the calm after the storm right now as people are filing out and breaking down from the day's events. But let me tell you something. It was surreal and truly incredible to see that total eclipse here in Burlington, Vermont. The sky was dark and the air was cold and it was truly something to see. So let me show you some video now of the moment of totality a couple hours ago. You can see the crowds of people reacting to that and they really just lost it. It was like a concert. It was so incredible to see the whole sky darkened over Lake Champlain and you could really see what was going on clear as day because we had great weather up here in Vermont. It was really breathtaking for a lot of people, especially those who came who had never seen this type of thing before. Here at Echo, where I'm coming at you live from, it's a science museum along the lake and workers here directed onlookers about what was happening and when they could remove their special glasses. There were a ton of watch parties and events today in Burlington and you could tell that the community really rolled out the red carpet to welcome these solar tourists from all over to here in Vermont's largest city. Now, thousands of people were watching along Lake Champlain. Here's how one of those onlookers described it. It was just so cool and the lake was like the most beautiful it's ever been and the energy was just like the energy the last couple days is like the city gears up has been so wacky and so like in a very positive way, but just so crazy um, and it got it like came to a head. It was so cool. Now, there are many after parties in the area tonight for people to attend if they'd like. A lot of people are leaving town, though, as well. Traffic on I-89 South looks pretty heavy at this time. It is two hours to Montpelier, and that's double what it normally would take. So just to give you an idea of how many people were here today. But for now, we're reporting live from Burlington, Vermont. I'm Matt Fortin, NBC10 Boston.